Uh, so here is our last question, question number 60. It says the distance is meters traveled by a particle after t seconds is given by s equal to t squared plus 3t plus 8. We are asked to find the velocity after 5 seconds. Remember what we are talking about here is the distance s. When we say velocity is the rate of change of a distance over some times, which is just the first derivative. When we talk about acceleration, is the rate of change of a uh, velocity over some time, which is the second derivative. So here we are going to find the, uh, the first derivative, which is ds over dt. Change in s over some times. This is equal to from here. These two will multiply down t at that power of t will subtract 1, 2 minus 1 is the same thing as 1. If you have a function that has a power of 1, it will just disappear, leaving uh, the coefficient 3. The derivative of constant is 0. So this is what we have as the first derivative, but we ask to find this change after 5 seconds. So we say at t equals 5 seconds, This is equal to 2 multiplied by 5 because we say t is equal to 5 plus 3. This time this is 10 plus 3 is 13. And the unit is meter per second. So this is our answer which we have here as option A. And this is the last question on that this paper. I wish you all the best. I wish you success in all your future endeavors. Thank you for supporting my ideas. And don't forget to follow my YouTube channel at Tambo Math Class. Have a nice day.